Hello guys, Wahoo here, back with another video. This time around I'm doing a tutorial on ring crafting. So if you don't know what ring crafting is, is if you open your uh, character tab, you can see it right here as a slot for rings. And they do give a minor increase to power rank, but what we're really after is the mastery you get out of it. Okay, so let's get into it and let's get that ring, ring on that finger. Um, first of all, you have to find the Novus crafting bench and you open that one up. It's on your cornerstone. You find ring crafting bench. It's right here and you can see the materials right there. Not too uh, crazy ones, but so um, when you have crafted the bench, you go into build mode by pressing tab and place it down on your cornerstone somewhere and you open it. So there's different tiers in the uh, uh, ring crafting and I'll go through them, but also, if you want to know, if you don't want to go back in the video and see how many, what, what you needed and how much you needed and stuff like that, it's all in the description. You can go there and there's the different tiers. So, first of all, you start out as a newbie and here you want to craft diamonds. And diamonds are these materials right here. You need a bunch of flux for it, uh, going through the whole thing. But again, like I said, it was going to be all uh, in the description about how much you need of the different things if you want to go through it all uh, in one go. So, first of all, you want to make the 50 diamonds. Uh, that will take you from 0 to 50. Uh, so you will be the, after that you will be the dappler. And here you want to make 50 of the each, uh, not f of each thing, but uh, 50 in total of whatever. So you can go with the health, or you can go with the physical, or the magic, or the laser man. It doesn't really matter which one you use, you just have to make 50 of the boxes. So that should take you to 100. So now you're an enthusiast and you make 50 more boxes and again, like I said, it doesn't matter if you take the health, the physical or the magic or the laser man. See, it could be a little tip if you take the one that um, works best for your class. So let's take, like for example, I am a, I'm on my shadow hunter right now, so I should make some physical ones. But it doesn't really matter. Here we're just trying to get the mastery out of it and it uh, doesn't really matter which one you take. So now you should be at 150 uh, levels uh, of uh, ring crafting and you will be a jeweler. And here again, you can make more uh, ring boxes. Again, it's pretty simple. It's exactly the same thing. It doesn't really matter which one you, you take. If you take the health or physical magic or laser mancy. I wouldn't, I wouldn't, pr I wouldn't um, take the land laser mancy because laser mancy is not really anything uh, you're really gonna use that's when you're in build mode and you use your laser to destroy blocks so When you're going up it might be a good idea to to use uh, either the physical or the magic one All right now you should be at 200 and we're in the uh, master ring crafter so um, here you want to go to um, you want to your 200 and again all the boxes are basically the same thing again like i said either the magic or whatever and now you should be at the lord of the rings which is the max tier 250 and here you can start making the shadow diamonds um which you can make the other boxes which is basically the same thing but here you're using the shadow diamonds and these are the ones that are there's a chance of you getting shadow rings and you can get shadow one two three and four four is the max and is really really rare so that does it for this video not too uh too crazy but like i said before if you want to see the tier so how much you need in total you can see it in the description if you like this video please give it a like and subscribe it helps me out a lot thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video bye